Okay. Good morning. Okay. So, uh, it is 7.39 and I have a big day. It's really just a long day. Right now, I'm doing my makeup. I feel like I have not yet mastered my makeup look. And I just be coming in here and I be doing whatever. Uh, that's that's really the only way I could put it. I just be coming up here and I be BSing. And I just hope it turns out right every single time. If I'm being quite honest, like I don't even have contour. I literally use um I literally use a eyebrow pencil as contour. I should just go and get me it but if I'm being honest I would need a friend to come with me to get makeup because I I don't be knowing what to get I, and I be getting stupid shit I be going to the I be going to Sephora getting stupid shit I, I kid you I kid you not bruh so I just need like one of my friends who is good at makeup most likely Kaya or Morgan I need them to help me <laughs> bad because they cool. Oop, not be saying my government. So, based off of our conversation yesterday, uh, it wasn't even really yesterday. It was the day before yesterday. I feel like I've been having so much FOMO lately that it's been putting me in such like a sad state of mind. I'm just dealing with like FOMO and feeling like pretty like feeling like pretty alone and, and stuff but I mean I'm not feeling like that anymore but I was and it was a terrible feeling it was terrible guys but you know I'm feeling a lot better now I just have to like change my mindset because you know I'm not alone like I have people here to help me but I just don't like to be a bother I don't like to always like ask people for help and I really don't like anybody knowing like my business okay so I finished my freaking makeup let me not trip over this chair I finished my makeup yes I think it looks I think it looks pretty good actually the only thing now that I have to do is freaking figure out what the heck I'm gonna wear today I have these clothes that was sent to me by Alfred Eden and I have to upload photos or I guess like a video of me in these outfits and I still have not put together outfits that I could wear to take photos in and since I'm gonna be meeting up with my friend today I wanted to wear an outfit just so I can get some photos but y'all like the the stuff that I got ugh, I just have to like figure out what the hell I'm gonna wear with them because Alfred Eden like all the clothes that they sent me are so, so, so big on me. And I literally got everything in a small. And they are huge. Like, literally, I'm about to show you. I'm about to show you. They sent me four items. This is their third time sending me items. So, I have 12 items of theirs right now. Um, and honestly, I don't even know why I haven't already asked Alfred Eden to start, like, paying me for promoting their brand. Because, so, um, I don't even know why I have it. I'm going to ask them if I collab with them next time to run me my money. But anyways, I got this leather, brown leather jacket from them. It's in a small. Clearly says small right there. Got it in small. And, I mean, look at it. <sighs> look at this. It's swallowing me. Like, bro. Like what am I gonna wear with this? Okay, actually I can I can probably no 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 no. <laughs> hmm. Like I just have to figure out what I'm gonna wear, and I will be doing that right now off camera because y'all just make me a little bit slower. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ooh, okay, guys. So I think I figured out what I'm gonna do. Anyways, um, so I'm gonna wear this corset top that I have super duper cute i'm actually going to wear the oversized it's not even oversized but i am going to wear the jacket that i said was too big because i'm just going to tie it up in the back and make it look good i know people be like you gotta wash your clothes before you wear them the only clothes i wash before i wear them are sheen clothes um clothes from the thrift 
and usually I always wash my clothes before I wear them but when it comes to outfits even I just never do it bro I don't know what it is I just never do it anyways anyways this is this is how the jacket is looking again very very oversized very very big but we're just gonna zip it up and tie it up in the back I think I already it's already tied up literally you probably just saw my cheeks because I forgot it was tied up in the back <laughs> the jacket And I think I might do a burgundy purse because I freaking just, I just love this purse so bad. Like burgundy is like probably like my second favorite color. And it just goes, it just goes, I think it goes. So I think I'm going to do this and then wear like my burgundy um, kitten heels as well. I can try to show y'all once I get my life together. Shit, I'm still recording. Oops, sorry guys.
didn't look bad, but it's just like it's I, I like wanted it to be though. like it should have been like um, that was his like style. And I was trying to see if I ever had a middle part before and I have it. So mm -mm. Like, this. and you did it, and you got that shit done by me. Like I am <laughs> not a professional. So how are we gonna do this? Oh, because you gotta take the wig back off to do the wig cap. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you think I should pull the wig cap up then? And then we just cut the wig cap? Hmm. But then, like, the only thing is, if you pull up the wig cap, like, it'll be, like, covering up your edges and stuff. But since this wig is so far back, the wig cap would we'll still be, be showing. Hmm. So, I'm not sure how we could finesse this. I'm back here. Like, it's still, like... Yeah, that's how my hair was before, too. <laughs> I think I'm it was sure. like midway and then my hair was swinging out. But she's like, your hair is big, so like you're not oh. gonna be able to tell with the red curly hair. Oh. So nobody uh, could tell. I'd be a little nervous about my edges like, now. Because you know the last time I had a wig, I lost all my edges. Who did like they hair just hair? grew back. Oh shit, yeah, yeah. Like they just <laughs> grew back. They just grew back. I have nothing to do with that, y'all. <laughs> yeah, this is a disclaimer. Nicole did not snatch my edges. <laughs> see, I think your edges just really love you. They just be acting right. You see how slick that shit is right now? Mine be curling my back so quick. My edges do not love me. You shit. gotta see me your in the morning. Your edges have been loving you since high school. I don't what? <laughs> yes! Let's not keep <laughs> like. Operating more, but... At least your edges grow. It seems like my edges just don't fucking grow no more. Like, that shit because you got snatched off by the wig and just bobbed. Bald and smooth. No, <laughs> so I thought my life was over when I lost my edges. I was like, bro, like, I'm never going to have the edges again. Like, they're gone. I was so bald in the front. Like, look at But back. I remember you showing me. Look at that it was that bad. It was so scary. <laughs> Let me show you, bro. Pertinent picture. When we was on our picnic. Do you see? <laughs> tricky for me can't seem to get that but uh i think it's just because of the way the wig is made like it just just it's yeah just, they just not come on it's just not, it, bro. Like. but i think it looks pretty good cool. oh, cool. and then like if you do your makeup it's gonna look even well i don't know if they're gonna drop on this thing it might be kind of yeah like once my hair is this though i just tie it down like a um like a little silk Thingy. Oh yeah. And then I just put my bonnet on my car. That's probably what I should do because I don't be doing that. Oh my god. Sissy Raven tonight. Hey baby. I'm crying. <laughs> <laughs> 